Hi, welcome back to part two of the uh, toiletspares.com.au series on toilets. Um, before we go any further, what we'll be looking at is some common thread types that are used in toilets and toilet repairs. Um, these are basic plumbing sort of um, fittings, and we're, uh, there's a lot of uh, misunderstanding as to how these work, so um, I'll just go through these. Okay, I'm going to start off by looking at a um, thread here which is very typical it's a British standard pipe thread a half inch and what's special about this thread is that it's tapered it's what's called a taper thread so what that means is that the at the beginning of this thread is actually a smaller diameter than at the at the far end and what that means is that as you screw this thread in it won't go all the way because it gradually becomes tighter and tighter so if I take this uh, which is the female and start to thread it in. It'll go so far, quite easy. It's quite, it's quite sloppy at the beginning. You see, it actually will move around quite sloppy. As you tighten it up, it becomes stiff and tight, and you eventually you can't get it in at all. As you tighten it, that um, the thread jams against the inside of the other thread. Now, the reason that it does that is so that it will create a seal in in doing so. So what we do is we put some thread tape around it, usually. You can actually use um, a sealing component, but often or commonly we use a thread tape. So we take our thread tape and we, we wind it around our thread. Now we wind it in such a direction as if we were winding a knot onto the thread. So remember righty tighty, lefty loosey, or right turn to the right to make it tight. So we, we take this round to the right as if we were screwing something onto it. If we actually th screw it on in the other way, if we roll it on the other way, it will peel off as we screw that thread in to the female. So we go around a few times. We don't need too many here. Then we pull it off. Make sure it covers all, all of the thread, especially up the top here, because that's where it's going to tend to seal. And then we screw that in. And as it becomes tighter, that thread tape will be screwed I'm jammed tightly in between those two threads and it'll create a seal. So that's how a tapered thread works. Okay, it, 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 um, it's like a wedge going into a hole and it gradually squeezes together and, and with a sealant in, in between it creates a, um, a seal. So that will seal instantly once you do that tight enough and you need to, it needs to be good and tight. Not too much as to, to wreck, especially with these brass fittings, but it's, it's good and tight until it seals. If it doesn't seal it, seal it, you can always tighten it a little bit harder. Okay, now in contrast, we have on the other side of this tap is almost exactly the same thread, but this is a parallel thread. And it's a, so it's a British Standard Pipe parallel thread rather than a taper thread. And this is designed to seal on this face here. I don't know if you see that. So it seals on this face here, and the, the, when the, the, the um, male goes, the female goes over the male, and it, the point of it is to push this little um, rubber washer here against the, the seal here. So it doesn't seal on the threads, and what we often see is people with a parallel thread and they try to put some thread tape around it, where it's not sealing, they'll put thread tape around this thread in the hope that it will seal, and of course it never will because the, the parallel thread won't tighten against itself. So this one will tend to go on nice and easy and then it gradually easy at first, sorry, I'll do it again. And it, it, it's the same difficulty all the way up until that rubber washer starts to pull hard against the face and that is now pulling the washer hard against that face and that's a parallel thread pretty standard pipe thread. So maybe a, a better example we can see on here, which we've got a, an inlet valve here. Typical, it's a Bester inlet valve. And you see this is again the same type of a thread. It's a half, half inch parallel thread, British standard pipe thread. But instead, So if that was um, a taper thread, this wouldn't go all the way on. But because it's a parallel thread, we can screw this all the way up. And what this does is as you, as you tighten that up against the cistern on the outside, then the inside pull, it pulls this pulls this valve down onto this rubber washer and seals on that rubber washer here. So again, if we have a leak coming through this on the outside, what we can see we'll see this part on the outside of the cistern. 
if we have a leak coming through there it's no good putting some um, thread tape around this thread because it won't seal it the seal is on this case is on that rubber washer on the inside okay thank you